Hey everybody, it's King of Koopies here. Welcome back to our first bonus part for Jazz Jack Rabbit. I'm not going to say 1.00G because we're not in 1.00G. As you can see, we're in 1.23 here. Why? Because I'm going to show off bosses that were changed, like, dramatically. Like, you know, in the case of the, uh, of the crab boss, I already showed that off. But I'm going to show the other ones that were either cut or heavily changed and how they are in the final game. We're going to start off with Bali, then we're going then we're going to go to Bubba, Devin, and finally Blissey. And hopefully that should show off most of the bosses. And so, anyhow, let's roll. I'll see you in flashback. And here we are. We are at the uh, the entrance to Bali. Now, just so you know, I've used cheats. I used the J -D the JJ next cheat in order just in order to get to this quickly. But I don't have any weapons. I don't have any power ups. I'm just gonna fight these bosses with my default blaster. I don't even have fast fire. So this ought to be fun. Let's do this. Now, when I was young, wow, got hit already. This boss, this boss gave me heck when I was when I was a kid, because I just had so many problems with them. I could never beat him when I was a kid. Here's an easy trick you can do, and then just use the uh, your uppercut to destroy all these. And as you can see, you can also you can also notice the sprite difference that's from in the final game. Oh yeah, just kill this guy so he's out of the way. Basically, he just fires missiles and locks onto you. He's actually a challenge, like, if you're not expecting him. I mean, when I was a kid, this was easily the hardest boss. I was stuck on him for months. Well, technically, I wasn't. I actually, when I used to, when I was young, I got my mom to fight the bosses because I was a wimp when I was a kid. Oh, shoot. So, yeah. And I remember, I think... I think finally, after so long, it was either my mom or it was me that I was fi was finally able to beat it. And if I die here, I'm going to be disappointed because once you know what to expect, this boss is actually really easy. Kind of thing that's funny in a 1.10... Wow, it keeps getting hit. What am I doing here? Die. Die. The burning fire. As you can tell, I'm a, I'm a little hyper from my end die there we go and that's that that is Bali I believe you can okay next level there we go <laughs> so anyway that's Bali uh, we are back here and we're gonna check out Bubba and here we are at the uh, battle entrance to Bubba so let's dive in ah that's there's that tornado move and there are those disappearing platforms again this boss isn't hard it's just it's just I'm I'm rusty. I've I've only been fighting the um uh, thing the uh, with the upgraded blaster and plus you know I don't have any powers and plus I think that fireball does two damage so and I think it goes faster. Yeah, he moves he moves really quick in uh, on hard mode. So I'm being merciful to myself in doing this on uh, easy difficulty simply because I value my life. Which sucks, because I'm sure some of you people want to see me fail, but we're almost done here as it is. Why will you not die? You will just refuse to die. And there we go. And this is not over yet. There's that message that I have no clue why it's displaying. And die! Okay. Alrighty, and we'll be right back for... Uh, Devin. Alrighty, and we're back here, and I've modded the um, Jungle 2 to have the Blissey boss at the end so that we can go ahead and just show it off. Well, not modded by Jazz Creation Station, did so. And there's Senor Asshole. Now, for the, to defeat this boss, you have to abuse the heck out of your invincibility while you're butt stomping. Pretty much butt stomp right before the fireballs hit you, and you'll gain brief invincibility from this fireball. Because those things are impossible to avoid otherwise. Trust me. I've never been able to defeat this boss without using this. Without using this. So, other than that, he's not that bad. His behavior is that he'll teleport around the arena. I believe it's he won't go 12 blocks from your from his spawn location. So yeah, he can teleport into the wall if you're not careful. And that's that. Whew, that actually got me kind of nervous there. And something you've probably noticed here. 
Uh, I said I'd do Devin and then Blissey, but I, I'm also gonna, sh I also, uh, showed off the ending in that part. This is actually being recorded after I did the Devin. So yeah, go ahead and, and, uh, we're gonna do that, the final part, so I can show the ending off as well. Alrighty, I'll see you at Devin. And here we go, we're at the Devin fight. What the frick am I doing? Putting the final boss with only a basic blaster? Well, I actually picked some toaster ammo, but that's not gonna do jack for us. So let's go ahead and fight Devin. Prepare for a lot of keyboard matching as he takes a lot of hits. And it's been forever since I've bought him. Yeah, this is his first form that was not in the final game. As you can also see, there's platforms you can take ahead of. Basically, the basic strategy what you want to do is just jump over him once he starts firing. And he shouldn't jump up to the platforms because that is actually kind of annoying to dodge. He should... Sometimes he'll um, uh, look like he's crouching. Not, nothing to worry about there. And sometimes he won't shoot. Man, we're learning a lot today, aren't we? Thankfully, this first form, again, this gave me problems when I was a kid. And there he jumped up to the platform and you have to run like like hell. I don't. I think that only does one heart of damage, but I don't feel like finding out because I did not want to die on the final boss. Especially considering I used so many cheats to get here. No, not really. Just keep firing. And here we go. We're at the second form. And here's that glitch I'm going to show off. If you butt stomp him, it gets sort of half of his health, but then you shoot him and it comes back. So you can really only use one or the other. If you use a mix, it's going to just frick up the life bar. So if you want... So just keep shooting him! And, uh, that fricked up his life bar. He actually has two life bars, which is really weird. He has a both. He has a physical one and, a uh, And a gun one. That's actually interesting. Not sure why it does that. So keep firing away! You would never fire, have enough fire. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. I can only get hit. I can only get hit two more times and then I'm dead. He's actually pretty fast on, on he's a lot harder on hard though, as I've said. And this takes too many blaster shots. I think it's something like 200 blaster shots. But thankfully I'm a master at, at mashing out. Oh shoot, nuggets. Do not die now. And uh, something else, you don't normally get points for defeating Devin, but if you butt stomp him when he's low on health, you can get the, um, you can get 10,000 points. I'll see if I can do that here. Come here, buddy. Get him really low in health, and... Boom! And that's that. Let's see if the ending plays, and if it does, I'll shut up and I'll let you watch the ending. And with that, I think we're going to end it off here. Now that you saw the ending. And wow, I almost got first place just by defeating the bosses. Okay, then. Well, I guess that concludes that. In the next part, we're going to go ahead. I think I'm going to show off the secret levels that are still in. Or at least hopefully still in 1.00G. G, and if they're not, we're going to go ahead and... Um, just show them off here. Anyhow, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next part.